Hello, I'm Svetlin Naku from SoftUni, and today I'm here for the next episode from my Dev Concept series. This is a very interesting lesson, especially if you are into front end technologies. In this lesson, you will learn which technologies help us, helps us build user interfaces for software apps and what is DOM, the document object model, and how we implement DOM interactions in JavaScript using the DOM API. Finally, I will explain and demonstrate the AJAX technology, the XML HTTP request and the Fetch API in JavaScript, which allows consuming RESTful APIs from the backend. Hey, I would love to hear from you. So let me know in the comments what else you would like to see on my channel in YouTube. Also, don't forget to like this video if you enjoy it because it helps us tremendously in reaching more people and spreading technology for free. Let's start now. The front end is what users see on the screen. It consists of the client side app components, the presentation layer of the software systems. The front end displays the user interface to the users and interacts with them. Let's review the concepts and principles of modern front end technologies, such as the DOM tree in web browsers, the REST architecture and RESTful APIs, AJAX and the concept of asynchronous invocation of backend services the concept of templating engines for URL rendering, the concept of routing for URL-based navigation, and the concept, concepts of URL libraries and front-end frameworks. Uh, web front-end, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, together with the document object model DOM, AJAX, and few others, are the dominant technology for building user interfaces for modern software apps. The set of web and front-end technology is now under the name HTML5 platform. Um, or the web platform. See HTTPS platform.html5.org for more details about the HTML5 platform. It consists of lots of technologies, APIs and standards uh, implemented in modern web browsers. It is very important for every HTML5 uh, modern software engineer to be familiar with these HTML5 technologies and the concepts behind them. Web front-end technologies uh, are the way developers build the user interface displayed in web pages, websites and web apps and cross-platform cross apps. The HTML, CSS, and CSS languages describe documents, content layout, formatting, and everything we see on the screen in the web browser. JavaScript, which is also called ECMAScript, is the main language used by developers to program user interfaces in a web browser. The DOM technology allows accessing the elements in the web page through JavaScript. The AJAX technology allows invoking backend services from JavaScript front-end apps. JS front-end frameworks such as React, Angular, Vue, uh, simplify the web front-end development by providing structure, components, guidelines, and patterns to build maintainable front-end apps. DOM, the document object model, defines uh, the structure of web pages.
Documents in the web browser are represented by a DOM tree. The DOM tree holds a hierarchy of UI and other elements. DOM uses composition and most elements could hold other elements within themselves. This way the elements are organized in a tree, the DOM tree. The DOM API allows changing the DOM from JavaScript. Um, code and this is how modern websites and apps build interactive user interfaces. Modern front-end apps manipulate the DOM tree directly from JavaScript or through a front-end framework and consume data from the back-end. This is a simple, uh, simple example of the DOM API. We want to build a web page uh, which calculates the sum of two numbers. And this is how it looks like. Three text fields and a button. The numbers are entered in the first two text fields. And when the calculate button is clicked, the third field displays the sum of the numbers from the first two fields. We create a JavaScript code snippet in the web page to handle the button click event. We find the button element uh, in the DOM tree by its ID and assign an event handler function for its onClick property. When the button is clicked, we use the DOM API to take the text content from the fields Then we parse the field values into numbers, calculate their sum, and display the sum into the was field. We use the DOM API function document.getElementById and the DOM properties on click and value to access the fields uh, and the button from the DOM tree representing the elements of the web page. I'm not going to explain this in more detail but since here I want to show you a concept, the DOM tree, not to teach you in HTML, DOM, JavaScript and web front-end programming. We shall have a comprehensive web front-end programming course at SoftUni in the end-to-end the -end learning track for software developers where we will learn and practice how to manipulate the DOM tree in more detail. Now it's time to demonstrate you the previous example in action. I have prepared a wife code example at repo.it and let's open the link. It takes time to load as usually. This is the same code from the previous slide. It takes two numbers and calculates their sum. Let's run the code. We enter 5 and 3 and the result is 8 as expected. Let's see the DOM tree here. The DOM tree is this structure. We have input, we have another input, we have another input and we have a button. And these fields have here values assigned in them. These are the properties of these 
elements. Did you like this lesson? Do you want more? Join the learners community at softunit.org. Subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more free video tutorials on coding, dev concepts and software development. Get access to more free dev lessons and learning resources for developers. Get free help from mentors and meet other learners. And it's all free, so join now, softuni.org.